All right, guys, welcome back to Half Fast 719. All right, we, this is the video is going to be for this U joint, for this half axle, half shaft. <laughs> so weird to say that. Anyway, um, I already started to try to press this out um, just because I had to figure out how to mock all this stupid stuff up. So I got these arbors sitting in here like this, like this, the socket sitting there. I've already had the shock it, socket shoot out at me. So, um, yeah, I'm going to give it a go. And uh, <clears throat> it's already a lot of pressure on there right now. So i got to do that and then uh, take it off, spin this, and uh, do that. So let's set you guys up over here and see if... I can't bust my grill out. So, um, yeah, fine. So, probably should be wearing some a face shield and, and some body armor, but I guess I'll just wear gloves. Let's see what this thing does. The bottom piece. Something fell off earlier. This piece broke and fell off. And you know what? I'm retarded. Hold on. I messed up. Apparently there's clips in there. <laughs> Alright, so if you take these clips out. These little C-clips. If you take these out, apparently this thing almost just falls out on its own. So, anyway, go ahead and press this out, get it out. So, and, uh, yeah, that was nice. That was nice of them to put these little clips in here. I was wondering why I was so tight, but whatever. Oh my gosh, this thing weighs a lot too. Yeah, so definitely, if you can, grease your bearings, grease all your U-joints. I mean, that's all dry in there. I don't know if you can see all that. It's just all dry and it's all rust. These needles shouldn't be coming out that easy. <sighs> Freaking people, man. No, it bugs me. chairs here it's so that it catches all my parts um, when I did the when I did the uh, what you call it the pinion berry I did the pinion bearing uh, ended up having to do uh, So, got this off. I don't know if you can hear it. It's pretty nasty. You can see it's all dry. Everything's dry in here. I'll have to clean all this up. Oh, I guess I'm not cleaning that up. I'm putting a new one in here. So, let me get this wheel bearing out of here. Wheel bearing <coughs> sounds good. Alright, now I'm going to start with. 
pulling these clips off. What do you guys think? <coughs> so, anyway, if I can even get them. Press it down a little bit, and yeah, let me get all this set up and press it out, and then I'll show you guys once it's all new. All right, so I'm gonna be pressing in the new U joints, the new U joint. Push this cap in all the way till the clip can go in. And you just want to make sure you put a clip in. Then when you put the other side in, um, it should work pretty good. Okay, so that's in. That side's pressed in. And then when you push the other side in, uh, it'll go in. So get this thing. Try not to lose any of the caps. This cap in here, like so. And then that socket just went. Oh, I really don't need a socket, but why not? So. And try to get this started in there as straight as you can get it. Make sure. Like the needle bearings came out a little bit. That's gonna be fun. Extra careful with these needle bearings. Yep. One bearing came down. So Put him back in his place. You stay there. Talk to it. You stay there. Don't don't come out. Get this seal out of here. Put it back on here. I guess the best thing you could do is put it back in there. Oh, man. Somehow, keep him, keep him up somehow. I think he'll be good. So, before I start putting some pressure on here, Pain, huh? But I don't want to do this thing twice or three times.
something because pressure on here and try it again. They're new guys. Somehow it just doesn't want. Quit. Need a socket. I don't have thin hands. Doing this just to get it started. Okay. Right there. Start pushing in. And it's falling ready. Sorry, my videos are long and boring, I know. So that one fell in there. Just gotta go a little bit more. Just make it so enough to get that clip in there. I'm just too tight is the problem. Anyway, it's in. I just gotta back it off a little bit because it's too tight right now. Get back to you.